So as you guys watched yesterday's franchise video, uh, I was going to do a new series, and it's going to be some Diamond Dynasty. Uh, as you guys know, uh, last week they released some new cards. Um, I got them all. Koji Uraro 95 overall Diamond, uh, 87 overall Gorilla with the Pirates. Uh, I also uh, got Billy Wagner recently for the Astro, so I put him in too. Uh, we got David Ross for 84 for the Reds. He has insane power and is a pretty good catcher. So free, really pretty decent catcher. Uh, 36 vision is the only downside. Uh, of course, low speed, you expect that. Uh, they released a new Prince Fielder uh, and a Mark Deshera. But Prince Fielder, honestly, this is his best f p card in the game for Prince Fielder. 92 contact against right, 73 against left, 95 power versus right, 60 versus left, though. And then a lot of vision. And he has some pretty decent fielding, too. Honestly, I think he's better than the other one. But then we have a Mark Teixeira who could play left field rookie for the Texas Rangers. Uh, 89 power versus left. 80 po contact versus left, 77 power versus right, and 82 fielding, 68 arm strength, 55 vision. This card isn't that bad in my opinion. They're giving us some pretty good cards for free. Put them in left field. Uh, second baseman, I believe there wasn't really that much of there. Uh, and then nothing for third base. Uh, the people I'm not filling in for these slots are going to be uh, Detroit Tigers because I was grinding the Tigers at this moment. Uh, but a 19-year-old, 1995 Aroid rookie... Uh, for the Mariners, 87 power, great fielding, great speed, and that's really all it about this card. It's basically a, you know, non-juiced version of this 99 card. Uh, but then left field, we don't have anyone there. Uh, and then center field, I don't think there's anyone there at all. Nope. Uh, and then right field, I did get this Alex Rios card, uh, so I finished his mission. So I'm going to put him in. Uh, a pretty decent overall card in uh, hitting stats and fielding and speed. So it's a pretty good uh, card to get, in my opinion, if you're just looking for a overall balanced card. I put him in center field because at this time I was working on Ryan Zimmerman mission as well. As uh, they're racing some division series, you know, cards and conquests and all that. So our lineups can be Rios, Fielder, Teixeira, Rodriguez, Ross, Zimmerman, Kinsler, and Castellanos. And then we're on the mountains with Verlander. And then we're facing the Hackers. They have their created player, Sin Chu Chu, Deja LeMahieu, Duvall, Tulitsky, Maurer, Grichuk, Gaddis, and they're pitching Zach Granke, who has had a terrible year. Uh, but I believe he picked it back up for the Diamondbacks. I have no idea, but he was a Diamond. Now he's a 91 gold. And I believe our my record is, you know, up there. But he's 92 and 70. So what's that? So we're going to go all the way to the bottom of the six. Is an even game. We're going to bring in Koji Uehara. Runners on the corner for him. No out. First time using him, 38 prime, Koji Uehara. He has amazing, nasty stats. I did not show you guys that. Sorry about that. But then he swings at a splitter. Still, we're in a jam. Looking to win our first game in this video. But he's going to hit this to right field. It's Diaz. And Zimmerman will make the catch. Probably wouldn't have made it there anyway. Actually, if he was ready to throw it in online, he probably would have... Uh, on, on, like, not offline, he probably would have got it. Uh, but it's one nothing him. And the bottom of the eight, we bring in Jason Grilly as we pitch it, and we warm up Billy Wagner as well. 87 roll, Jason Grilly, 36 years old for the Pirates. In the bottom of the eighth, 32 count slider to Evan Gaddis, 02 count, excuse me, and he swings at it. Honestly, Koji Orhara and Gaddis are both, I mean, not Gaddis, uh, Grilly are both really decent cards. I would definitely recommend getting that. Now, top of the ninth, closer in for him. Prince Fielder up, he is a nasty against righties. As he chops this off, he could have potentially catch it. He's running back and won't get it. We chop off a fastball. 0-1 oh, count, one out in the inning. Here comes the pitch to Prince Fielder. And a hack really looking to knock that out. 0-2 oh, count, one out. Here comes the pitch from Wade Davis. And Prince Fielder hits this the deep right field. And that is going to be way gone. A monster home run, which ties the game in the ninth. Clutch hitting by... Prince Fielder, and the bottom of the ninth, Grilly still in, runners on first, he's running, and Tixera is not going to be able to get there in time, diving for it, the runner will score, and that's how we lose the ball game, Granky wins, he wins by a final score of 2-1, to one. thank you guys for watching, and let me know if you want to see more Diamond Dynasty, well, of course, I'm going to be making more Diamond Dynasty, uh, if you want me to do some certain team things like that, uh, show off cards I get, I will definitely do that, but thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.
what we do here is go back, 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 back.